You turn up the AC, please. What are you doing to keep on the cool side, Kelly? I'm knock, knock. Cool side, this is your friend in high places. Wow. Hey, it's been a while. Yeah, I haven't spoken to you since Operation Doomsday. I know I never thanked you for saving my ass back then, and uh, yeah, I'm not going to. That's against agency policy. And now down to business. I can't tell you much as long as you're still just a civilian. But I can tell you this. It's hot as hell outside, and gas prices are through the roof. We can't change the weather, but maybe we can do something about the price at the pump. You think you know what's behind it? Well, the correct answer is no, you don't. And forget everything you've heard in the news, and forget all the brain-dead conspiracy theorists on Life Invader. Now, you want to know the truth? Well, we're going to need to bring you in. And we're prepared to swear you in as a special field operative. You'll be one of us, working under our umbrella. Only you'll be significantly better paid. <laughs> Sound good? Then report for duty at IIA headquarters. All right, let's get you sworn in. Raise your right hand. I do solemnly swear that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States, as interpreted by my immediate superiors in the IAA. That my duties may include interrogation, uh, phone tapping, suppressing reports, inventing reports, uh, paying bribes, taking bribes, the trafficking of drugs and arms, uh, the misappropriation of funds, and uh, lying to the American people whenever strategically necessary. So help me God. I'll take your silence as an enthusiastic consent. Congratulations! Welcome to the IAA, Agent. Earpiece working? Good. But because your first assignment begins immediately, send you some coordinates. Get moving and I'll brief you. Find some of their uniforms. If you're surprised the FIB are tangled. 
tracking device. Nothing personal, just so we can follow your progress. Okay, on you go. you retrieve confirms my suspicions. The Duggins are buying tech from the FIB's collection of seized assets as part of their strategy to keep profits high. Yeah, we'll know more once our lab guys have gotten into the hardware you requisition. In the meantime, I've got good news and bad news. Bad news? Your recent visit to FIB headquarters has caused a few ripples, and there are some fingers pointing our way. Good news? That means we're definitely onto something. I smell a conspiracy. And if anyone knows what conspiracy smells like, it's us. We need to make a few moves to keep the FIB off our backs. Report for duty at your next opportunity. Conspiracy to defraud the American public. 
But in the meantime, your little visits to the Bureau <sighs> sent them into full-scale crisis mode. We've got surveillance drones all across the city. There's no way we can operate while we're being watched. The agency does the watching. Find those drones and hack them. If we can trace them back to a base of operations, maybe we can find another clue to what the Duggins are up to. And uh, don't worry about compensation. We've got a fund at the agency that specifically ring fence for keeping our colleagues at the Bureau in line. Once you've found a drone, use the SecuroServe app on your phone to hack it. Now, if you're gonna destroy it, wait until the hack is complete. Yeah, I'm gonna need access to all of them to locate whatever command center they're using to run this up. Good, that worked. We're at the start of a trace here. Sounds like no one's there. Uh, there must be a computer of some kind to control the drones. Uh, can you get me access to it? Perfect. Okay, let's see what we're dealing with. Oh boy. Uh, these planes are... Uh, oh no, get out! It's a trap! Repeat, exit the building immediately! Agent, do you copy? Agent! Hydrogen peroxide this is your debrief. Fast work back there. Yeah, that should keep the Bureau off our Later, backs man. for a while. Hey, which is good, because now we have a different problem. One of my best undercover agents infiltrated the Duggan organization as soon as prices started to climb, and she was getting somewhere. Until 24 hours ago when she stopped checking in. Now in our business, 
That's the kind of red flag we don't ignore. And seeing you're the senior field operative on this case, uh, she just became your responsibility. Report for duty as soon as you can. God, did Bernard send you? Did she just call me <laughs> Tell her that's a disciplinary matter. We need to get out of here, now. Sit rep, we have two groups of hostiles. Cartel soldiers, possible links to Marabunta Grande, and Duggan personnel. Both highly dangerous. They are hostile to each other and us. We need to evacuate this area and regroup staff. I thought I was dead back there for sure. How the heck did you find me? Recent GPS locks in my car? That was good work. They told me I was heading to a deal. I figure it's business as usual. No clue they'd made me. I just had time to knock it up, and next thing I know, there's a black bag over my head. I think they were planning to sell me as leverage to the cartel. I don't know what the hell happened. But the deal went south, people started dropping left and right. You got there just in time. Shit. So are you new? I don't recognize you. <sighs> Thank you anyway. It's been a second to get my shit together, okay? So I'm guessing you're on the Duggan Op? Let me tell you, this stuff goes deep. Way deeper than our models predicted. It's got Bureau written all over it. I was so close to putting it all together before my cover got blown. Anyway, here's what I can tell you. The Duggans are putting together some kind of next-gen computer software. That's how they're fixing the price of gas. This thing is exploiting backdoors everywhere, including the goddamn Balsack data center. It's manipulating trade prices, supply, demand, shipment delays, rating agencies, public oversight mechanisms, you name it. It's even pushing panic buying using bots on social media. The Duggins already have most of the tech they need, and they're out to buy even more than the FIB's confiscated items. Whatever's going on, we need to move on it fast. Uh, I feel a little faint. Could you take me to the hospital? Debrief's gonna have to wait. Thanks. Again, hopefully my intel fills in some of the blanks. I'm sure you'll get a copy of the mission report. Good work today. Now, having successfully undertaken field work in temperatures of over 100 degrees, I'm giving you a direct order to take a shower before your next report for duty. But for today, that was some fine work, Agent. Thanks.
All right, debrief. Agent Johnson's report indicates that the Duggins are leveraging some kind of hyper-advanced neural network to inflate gas prices. Now, from what the lab rats tell me, it's essentially an AI program capable of manipulating every aspect of the global oil market to their advantage. And restricting supply here, creating deficits there, delaying stocks, stoking panic buying. It's coming from every angle. That's why it's been so hard to trace. Now we have reason to believe that due to our recent actions, they're moving the tech to a more secure location. Let's intercept it and see what we can find. Report for duty. Debrief. <sighs> our teams have gone through the hardware you recovered from the Duggins. And I'm afraid it's confirmed our worst case scenario. Remember Clifford? Yeah, Avon hurts his AI neural network with a minor genocidal glitch? <laughs> of course you do. You were there for the kill. Well, it's back. Or at least part of it is. That's what the Duggins have been using to control the price of gas. You're buying archived Clifford backup drives from the FIB. <sighs> Idiots. They've got no idea what they're playing with. Our pushback has them against the ropes, but they're making one last play. Report for duty as soon as you can. We need to intercept that deal. Cliff. 
effort. Unbelievable. It seems Mr. Hertz's genocidal AI is the turn that just won't flush. Leave it to the Duggins to come and scoop it out of the bowl. Then go to the construction site at the Mile High Club. Mason Duggan is making a deal with the Bureau for whatever Clifford Tech they still have. Okay, these are the same FIB drones we ran into before. Let's use the back door you hacked to take a look around. Okay, pretty much as we expected. Now where's Mason Duggan? Plenty of guards. Bureau. Bingo. Mason Duggan. Yeah, I don't recognize the other guy, but he's definitely FIB. Yeah, you can tell from the five-foot pole up his ass. Now, the Clifford Drive must be in that case. That is our primary objective, is that clear? The elevator looks like our best option. Now, you'll need a key card. One of their men must have one. Good work, Agents. <laughs> Crisis averted. But I'm afraid the debriefs don't end here. Now, if we want to be sure this kind of thing can never happen again, there's one loose end we still need to tie off. The service at Avon Hertz Asylum. Now, if there's any Clifford data remnants on them, we're always going to be looking over our shoulder for this kind of thing to happen again. Now, I need you to get in there and finish it. Permanently. Report for your final mission when you're ready.
Mission coordinates are at the top of Mount Chiliad. Specifically, in the late Mr. Hertz's personal silo. I left an agency helicopter for if you want to travel on a company dime. We're gonna put this thing to bed for good. That means any trace of Clifford software on the original servers must be eliminated. No data remnants, no residual algorithms, no magnetic representations, nothing. Our monitoring station reports that the power is back on. Good work. Now get to the servers. I every server torched using the software I put on your phone. When you get close to a server, it'll overwrite any residual data as long as you stay in range. It'll also make a final extractable copy of the Clifford data, which will be held by the app on your phone. Your final assignment will be to deliver that copy to me. In case you were having trouble remembering, you took down the original firewalls on these servers last time you were here. This is just our internal security we're getting past. Connecting should be trivial. Okay, that's 
the first one done. Uh, is everything okay down there? The remote monitoring of the system just went crazy. <laughs> Okay, looks like you're out. I wish I could begin my congratulations, but our surveillance assets tell me that some of Hertz's former soldiers have made their way to your location. We've had reports of these guys operating independently since a doomsday affair. They do not under any circumstances die. If they get a hold of what's on your phone, there's no telling what they'd be capable of. Now we're on the home stretch. I'm sure you're wondering why the agency has decided to make that final of the Clifford data. Murder. You recall our objective. To prevent the Clifford data falling into the wrong hands. Well, things, my friend, are very much the right hands. With this at our disposal, we'll be in a position to readjust the price of gas and without resorting to the old playbook of assassinations, false flags, and great collections. Even this old agency's got to move with the times. See? All for the greater good. Sweet Jesus! Again, your final payment is clearing now. Go buy yourself a cold beer. You've earned it. Agent, consider this your final debrief. <laughs> the Duggins operation has been effectively neutralized. Agent Johnson has been promoted to special agent. The last known copy of the Clifford software is safely in the hands of the IAA. I'm looking at accommodation. And you, I hope, are looking at your bank account. Even the weather forecast is looking up. As of next week, tropical storms. <laughs> and as for the price of gas, well, we think we're going to keep it where it is for now. See how this plays out. So, well, it gives me great pleasure to say, job done. Your official status as a special field operative is hereby placed on a definite hold, subject to reinstatement without a warning or consultation, a pending final committee review. In other words, you're out. <laughs> You've done good things for us, and we are grateful. From here in, you're alone. Goodbye.